everybody's your rubbish dear. Dead dog, dead puss, dead man, dead woman, dead everything. Welcome back to My View TV, the people's platform, the home of undiluted news, reviews, updates, and your daily dose of entertainment. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. Leave us a comment, like, share, and subscribe. I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see, when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple me. The biggest source of motivation are your own thoughts. So think big and motivate yourself to win. Wagwan well, my people, open body no cake, open body no right. No matter how difficult yesterday was, just know that today is your day. Stay positive at every moment of your life. Yes, people, today is Sunday. Why go off your red rice and roast up? We know all the people that put the roast that thing. Some people say, Watch out, my viewers say food we are eating. Some say, Yo, we're not going to eat enough. One thing I'm going to rice. That is why you have eat it. You understand? You work hard for buy that. So, anyway, people, you want one power, want one now. A fool and his money shall always depart. You understand? We know now and now we are talking about just wait, man. Get your money and go and drink and go and guess what I'm to you next. Dead, you're dead. Anyway, people. A Westmoreland man who used the postal service to export ganja, convicted. A Westmoreland man who attempted to use the postal service to ship ganja to Canada was convicted in Kingston and St. Andrew Parish Court. Alton Andis, age 49, pled guilty to 66 count of breaches of the Dangerous Drugs Act and was remanded until January 9, 2023. Andis appeared before the court charged with 22 counts of possession of ganja, 22 counts of dealing in ganja, and 22 counts of attempting to export ganja. Information reaching on news team that Andis attempt to use the Jamaican Postal Service to ship 22 parcels with ganja valuing more than a million dollars to Canada over a two-year period. An investigation was launched and the accused man was arrested by narcotic detective during an operation on September 22nd in Westmoreland. Investigators said there are other allegations against Andis regarding a Eight additional ganja seizure detected by police since January this year. The police say they are urging members of the public to desist from attempting to use the postal or the other courier service to export drugs as it's the criminal offense. Anyway, when they get them, don't slap them with. Well, on a bit, they know me tired for telling people them take them time on the road. But since they're not here, maybe read about them. Seven more motorcyclists killed in traffic crashes. It was another bad week for motorcyclists with five of them along with two pillion riders being numbered among the nine road fatalities amongst the nation roadway. Additionally, two more motorcyclists perished in motor vehicle crashes on September 27 and 29, bringing the road fatalities for the period to 11 and 352 overall since the start of the year. The latest statistics was released on Friday by the RSU, which is the Road Safety Unit, that shows two female pillion riders were killed in two different collisions on Saturday, October 1st. One pedestrian and a driver of a private motor vehicle were also killed. Meanwhile, RSU is reporting that as of October 7, some 352 persons was killed. 105 fatal collision. A breakdown reveals the top three categories with the highest numbers of fatalities were motorcyclists, 104 fatalities, pedestrians, 69 fatalities, and private motor car passenger, 49. Further stats reveal that 85% were male. Yeah, and the man some big idiot to understand. And they kill off themselves in a paper. The man must step on the road and do be a stupid this man a little piece of old bike and them little sitting there. But hold on a bit there now. And only someone a kill off themselves, you know. Listen to this one here. The body of a man was found riddled with bullet mere hours after he left a bar on Saturday in Petersfield, Westmoreland. The deceased has been identified as 25 year old Sudan Muir, otherwise called Bro. And guess what kind of work Bro do? Bro is a laborer. Yes, people are laborer. The police are theorized that the man was killed between the hours of 1 a.m. and 5.55 p.m. Saturday. Yes, I mean, no, now I wonder why they made a really kill this labor here now. People come like him really a swing bucket for true. You understand? Report reaching on news team on the police that on Friday, October 7 at about 7 p.m., Muir was seen at Paradise Lounge along Petersfield Main Road, drinking and spending from a large sum of cash. Yes, people. 
drink and I spend a whole heap of money, you understand? The man then left at about midnight. Following the departure, citizen heard some explosion at about 1 a.m. on Saturday, coming from the vicinity of Muir House. However, the police were not alerted. People them not really based about that side, you understand? They reportedly stumbled upon Muir's body at about 5.55 the same day in his yard in a pool of blood. They then contacted the police after they done shot the man money. Think on easy. Think on the people easy. Anyway, on the other police, Moore was seen on his back at the side of his house with what appeared to be multiple gunshot wounds to the upper body. Upon further checks by the police, it was revealed that the back door of Muir house was pried open. Yes, people. It just easy to kick off because the inches they turned the wrong way. But since you don't know why, listen to me, make all the inches stay that way there. Anyway. The DVR for his camera system was also missing. Make I tell you this. And the same people in the community, sister the youth, a drink and a spend a whole heap of money and have a whole of money in his pocket. And say, watch out, we're going to rob him. Rob him, we're going to rob the youth and kill the youth. That is that way that is concerned. When I depend on any of the map, I just go search around the Cornwall College. Yes, right around the Cornwall College, I go. And I know they can stack up much, I go watch. And Pam, I go link. And Pam say, my view forward, come link me. Come here, some information for you. Tell me fellow classmates them say school reunion now go nice this year because them slap with the sound man. When? I me say where you say Pam? Yeah man just tell them say them slap with advance, you understand? Dead, dead, dead. And for the people them wonder who me a talk about. Yes, him see one name so. So that is that. People here wag one pan wag one now. I want to know if you listen to this video. I listen it, I listen it keenly, you understand? And then make a chat about it, okay? Alright. Right now my blood, my blood hot, no blood clot, me not like my blood hot. You see? Me go for my daughter a school a while ago. She got exchange primary school. Right? And my daughter tell me, say, mommy, she an eight year old. My daughter said, say, mommy, me think me did have a, have a good day today, but it turned out for me not so good. Me suggest, what is the problem? Right? Now, before me even going night, me forgot my case, because I have three minutes. My, my daughter spoiled. She spoiled till she, she not do nothing for herself. She spoiled till she can't even she, she may not even teach her to tie her shoes this. My bad, not get me wrong. Right? So um because I know she, she me not, me not get for, she not can't get to tie her shoes properly. problem. Say, All right, Jessica, because you're not get for know how to tie your shoes is properly when if you their school until the man says if you're their school and your shoes is pull and you can't tie push it down in your shoes, right? Mr. Jessica, what is the problem? Jessica will tell me, say, Mommy, um, when a breaks time, she left to go buy her breaks. She in her line stand up and her shoes just pull. And this one teacher come up to her and tell her, say, tie your shoes lace. And she turned to the teacher and she tell the teacher that she cannot tie the shoes lace. The teacher said, tie your shoes lace. Right? So she said she stand up and open the teacher see her because she tell the teacher that she cannot tie her shoes lace. Right? She did not the teacher can't cancel and say, tie your shoes here. She stand up the same way. The teacher take her out of her line and say, tie your shoes here, you're not getting nothing for yam. And the teacher take my pin out of the blood clot line and send my pin in her class. My pin in their school freaking hungry. Freaking hungry during break time. Be just because she just bend down and tie her shoes here. And the pin tell the teacher, say, teacher, me can't tie my fucking shoes here. And you go tell me, say, the teacher take my pin out of her line. She go eat and she take the pin out of her line. And can't pin go put back in her class. I'm a pin for your ball in her class because she's freaking hungry. Because she can't tie her shoes lace. A bumble cloth when time you go up at school tomorrow morning. Me no want nobody tell me nothing when time you go up at school tomorrow morning. To that the fucking teacher that me said, Jessica, you know a teacher? He said, yes. She know the teacher. And I shall be going to that teacher tomorrow morning. I no want no blood clot body wall me. Come tell me all oh, that the teacher that's a fucking team. The little girl not tie her shoes later. You got to tell me, say, you got to make a pin and not eat because she not tie her shoes. She not have to tie her shoes later. Yes? Yo, you want my brother, my blood, that boil in a blood clot for that t shirt tomorrow, man. I swear upon my pin in their life. When I go to school tomorrow, man, in the man. You got to tell me, say, the pin can't tie her shoes later. And you got you 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 to punish her by not make sure fucking eat. You better you punish her some, in a, some other ways, man. But you got to punish her with food. Hey. Me saw my blood hot, my blood hot, my blood hot, no blood clot. Me and the teacher tomorrow, you know. Remember me tell you, you know. Hey, good morning. Okay, um, so I I made a video about like two days ago, um, about um my child 
and the teacher at um, exchange school right so I know it's out there and what has been said by my child I went up by the school and I got some information now first the information I got was totally different from what my child said right okay so it's like this I'm going to be the, the bigger the a bigger person and say this um, when I got the information from my child my head chip my head it chip same time um, because me know my daughter have a heating problem and when she tell me say she didn't get to heat that trigger me off same time right no I didn't react in front of my child but when I post the video she weren't there um, so I went on social media platform TikTok, and I said some things that I no regret of saying as in what and what I'm going to do I mean no what I'm not what I want I'm going to do like watch me and the teacher when I go to school as if me I go to school go beat the teacher <laughs> no I want to never fight in my life I am not a fighter I don't do those things um, it scares it scares the teacher it scares the school because they thought that I was going to the school to make war in which that wasn't the case so I am apologizing <laughs> to the school and to the teacher for th them thinking that I was going to come there and build war. Um, sometimes when we kids come home and say things whether I go so or not, we have to stop as parents and look into it, right? Look into it, question the kids more and all. So my behavior, um, as I have hope burst and all because I was upset um, and I went on social media, it wasn't called for. Yes, I stood low and I apologize for all of that. I apologize for even bringing in the school name in the um, on the platform and all of that. My apologies, but I'm just saying to parents, um, as from now on, you know, when the kids come home, come and say certain stuff. Yeah, we can go home, get upset and all of them those things. Yes, but we must just quick for react to certain things. If we find out how we go and whatever, whatever, whether it goes or not, if we take it at a better. Um, Take a better um, tool and doing it instead of get upset and get mad and go on social media, whatever, da da da.